Hello everyone, it's Call Me Lavender here, and you could call me that. In today's video, I will be showing you how to do your nails without Lena doing them, because she is pure evil. So yeah, okay, without further ado, let's get into the video. First, let me just like explain why we're going to be like doing our nails without Lena doing them. First of all, she's super evil. She, um, she took Lana and replaced her. And this is confirmed. So I'm actually just going to show y'all how she does my nails. Hey everyone, before we um, start the Halloween event, just a little disclaimer. The following quests refer to horror element, spiritual slash mythological connections and references. This is not meant to offend anyone. Recommended age for quests is 13 plus. Your discretion is advised. That's just a little disclaimer um, before we continue the video. Alrighty, let's get into it. Okay, everyone, so if you haven't done the quest yet, then all these are probably locked except for chapter one, which is where you want to start. And I do recommend having the witch broom out of VIP because it's going to help in chapter two. Um, not chapter one yet, but chapter two. Alrighty, let's go in chapter one. I personally really like this candy corn witch I made. Okay, so what you want to do is find Lana's childhood home. So, um, just follow what we're doing. If this is a little complicated, go to Lana Ray's channel, or Lana's Life. Hey everyone, Editor Lavender here. Um, just so y'all know, I will try to remember to link, um, Lana's Life channel in my description just so y'all know in case y'all need help with the maze Alrighty, bye hope this video helps by the way bye um and she will show you how to get through here you have to do it in under two minutes in order to uh continue and if you do accidentally um lose all of your hearts in a quest and you have to restart don't worry, even if you, like, don't feel like doing it at the moment or if you just run out of time, um, you could always rejoin that same chapter later. And, um, whenever you're doing this, make sure you have your volume up so you can hear it. So, what you do in chapter one is all you do is you find all the keys to unlock everything and you find all of Lana's stuff. Because, um, also there's a little monster that like tries tagging you um it really just like kind of follows you at a walking speed but it is not that hard to run into them it will jump scare you i personally don't think it's like that scary it never made me jump before but if you're a little scared of jump scares then just be prepared if you hear a beeping noise in my video that means jump scare coming soon okay guys so you could go ahead and go inside of the house um and then just be aware of the little monster. Oh, he is glitched. But the witch broom is a little hard to move around. Um, but you'll definitely need it in chapter two if you have it. Okay, guys, I will be back whenever we go to chapter two. We are in chapter two now. So this one is probably the hardest and creepiest. So what you do is you try not to alert her. So that means you need a broom so you don't step on it, as you can see. And um, it doesn't alert her if you have a broom and you step on that. But you still need to be careful of running into her and closing doors. <laughs> Whenever there's a little black thing around your uh, screen, that means she is nearby. So all you do is you find all the map pieces and then after you do that, she will chase you and then you just have to find the medical plane or something like that. I forgot what it's called, but yes. Uh, make sure before you do your quest, try to get as many tips. So look, here it is, floor two, medical wing. Sorry, uh, it's medical wing. So you come running up the second floor, to the second floor, and you come in here. Um, so yeah, now the debris has been cleared. Escape through the medical wing. But as you could see, there is the gas. Um, you have to follow the trail too. And just 
letting y'all know it is a little scary. Alrighty, after you complete chapter 2, you can move on to chapter 3. So, okay guys, all you do in chapter 3 is you complete the maze, then you fight the boss. A.K.A. Lena, because she is evil. So, after you complete all three of the chapters, um, you could go ahead and collect your four or five items. I believe it's four. Um, they are, this event is only for a limited time, so make sure to do it before it leaves. Also, another thing is this all leads to you being able to have Alana do, doing your nails. So, alrighty, I will show you everything you get from it. Okay, everyone, after you complete those three chapters, aka all the quests, um, you will get some items. So, I will show you. So, you come to where you save your outfits, then you click on the trophy, and you scroll down a little, and you will see all four of the items. You, you get this bird cage with three different toggles for your hand, cage, and shoulder. You get this wonderful shield with two different toggles, the default, which is in front of you, and the side one. It's very cool. You also get this wonderful dress with four different toggles. As you can For see, Dino Man you do have to be went ahead and put on man the male outfit. And put on the achievement item for me so I could show y'all. By the way, Mustache Man is Dino Man. I need to do my nails, so while we're at it, let's go see if Lon is there to do my nails. Final reveal, let's see. <gasps> Lon is here! Oh my gosh, yay! I can't wait for her to do my nails! Woohoo! Look at how pretty she made my nails. It matches my outfit perfectly. Alrighty, everyone. Evil Lena. Video and whoever was on Lena's um, side, um, my hate to offend you, but um, you were wrong. So, yeah, make sure <laughs> but yeah, alrighty, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Hope this video helped, and thank you so much for watching again. And help me reach my milestone 500 subscribers. Alrighty, guys. That's it for now. Goodbye. Content or Warbox content. Let me know. Bye.